Okay, uh, hi there. I'm- I'm back. I, it's been a while since I've done a actual video. It used to be like one every week and it's been what, three months? So I've been doing irregular shorts. It, it went from like being like every, every day to being every other day to being like twice a week and now I'm barely one a week. But we, we don't talk about that, okay? The hush hush. But do you know what time it is? It is time of the year for the queer. That's right, it is Pride Month, in case none of you already knew. And it's already like the 20-something 20, 20 of the month, so if you didn't know, I'm a little concerned about your perspective of time. But yeah, I decided to make an illustration for Pride Month. Okay, so the program I used, Clip Studio Paint, you can record time lapses, and those are automatically sped up because, like, storage space, they understand. But I didn't have to speed this up, like, or slow it down extra or anything. I took four days on this illustration. S seven and a half minutes of it already being sped up. Usually I, like, slow down my speed paints to make videos longer, but, like, oh my god. And I still feel like it's incomplete. But I'm pretty happy with it. I don't know, but I just felt like making the main woman a lesbian was right. And like, as a woman lover myself, I was like, you know, I want to give her a belly dancer-esque attire. Because that's, that's, that's kind of hot. And then also belly dancing is like, impressive. So I was just like, you know what, it's kind of random, but I'm going to do it because I need an excuse to do strange outfits with excessive jewelry yes yes you're right it is the beginning of a new trend i am doing a background not even just like a plain old oh i'll do a solid color and i'll distort the colors a bit so it actually looks fancy no i am drawing things folks bear witness to not only my success but my suffrage just so you know, this drag queen that I'm drawing, her name is Honey Lynn Ruby. You will respect her at all costs. She is my baby, and I haven't even drawn her in full size. Also, a another sign that we are beginning a new era. Did you notice the new intro? Yeah, yeah, you see that? I actually put time and effort into that. Got lazy at the end, but time and effort is there. And I, re I redesigned my persona. Notice that too. I'll be making a new profile picture of the speed paint, and uh, yeah. Also, oh my gosh, you guys, the comments you've been leaving, they so nice, make me so happy. I don't even care if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, just leave me a nice comment and I promise you, I will cry. I'll record it even if you want proof, like, this, it makes me so happy, I am such a simple person. Okay, back onto the topic of like my art, this hair, literally a pain in my ass. Mm -hmm brought me so much pain and agony so i had to go back and i had to watch a hair tutorial by colleen please like go watch her literally my lifesaver but i had to go back and like look at how she drew hair because i my brain just completely forgot because i've been doing traditional art for a while now like i finished my sketchbooks if you watch my shorts i i was lost okay i was completely lost another thing i'd like to mention why this drawing probably took so long? I was hyper focusing on every detail. Like, it was a problem. I spent an hour and a half on the tattoo alone. Like, oh my, holy sh. Every fold, every crevice, every particle of light I had to focus on. Very random, but like. Would you guys want to do a Q&A? You could ask questions about like me, Ayub, the weird artist who has edgy art one moment and wholesome as heck content the next. Confusing. Or my OCs, which I mean I have a decent amount of. We have like the originals, we have Ruru and Amina, we have the next ones, we had Zayn Amir, I almost forgot the names of them for a second. How dare I? Uh, then we have, then we have Cameron. I love Cameron so much. And then we have Jane, Alyssa. 
There's a lot of gay shit happening on this channel. Oh, oh god. Side note about my OCs, I'm, I'm sorry for not posting much lore on, like, any of them. Like, I kind of just dropped Cameron in there in the, like, out of nowhere. Same with Jay and Alyssa. All you know about Jay and Alyssa is they're probably in a relationship. And then Ruru and Amina, you kind of know about their backstory. Kind of know about Zay's backstory. Like, Amir's practically know nothing. I could do more lore, but I don't really have the energy for it. And I'm already doing a lot just for this video because like, I want to, I did the intro and then I want to add little PNG things to like show emotions, which at the time of recording this, I don't have those. So we'll wait and see if I actually have like stamina to do that. But yeah, I've had like a lot of ideas in my head and Recently, I've I've been working on like the plot for my webtoon, which I do plan to make, but I don't exactly know when. But it's gonna be called Hazardous Housemates, and it's gonna be about two housemates didn't really expect to run into each other. They have weird pasts, and there's not gonna be any cliche like, "Oh, I secretly knew you." No, I promise it's gonna be better, okay? And I'm not gonna spoil it further than that. But I'll just say, okay, I will spo spoil it further than that. I will say there'll be a lot of gay shit. I, I can promise that. But yeah, I've been working on like character designs. I've been working on kind of just doodling them. I've also been working on like plot and stuff because I forget that plot needs to be a thing. So, I'll like, I'll create these OCs, and I'll give them such a good backstory. But where that backstory leads to, I have, I have no clue. My brain just dies. It spontaneously combusts, and there's no coming back. We're not gonna mention the amount of times I had to redo the flags in this, because I knew the order, but my OCD was preventing it from happening. But anyways... How do you like it? I'm 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 really happy with the turnout. It, it took forever, but oh my god, she's so pretty. They're all so pretty. Oh my god. Whoa! Welcome to the end of the video. Was not expecting it to be that quick, but uh, if you made it this far, little sneak peek about my OC Amir. He's not alive. Can't tell you more than that, but he's not alive. Thank you so much for watching my video and comment down below if you have any ideas of what you want to like, what I should answer in a Q and A. And yeah, just keep chilling.